Nine California counties are reporting a spike in new coronavirus cases or hospitalizations of confirmed cases, raising fears that authorities may have to reimpose or tighten public health restrictions aimed at slowing the virus's spread. New diagnoses in the heavily populated Los Angeles area are going up in part because testing is more widely available. But officials say infections and hospitalizations in most other parts of the state are being driven by factors tied directly to the loosening of restrictions or overt flouting of public health rules. It is too soon to see whether cases will also spike after protests over the death of George Floyd swept the state. In Sacramento County, which had 33 hospitalizations of COVID-19 patients and 14 in its intensive care units as of Tuesday, health officials said the rise in infections is tied to recent gatherings, including birthday parties and a funeral. Many of the cases that are showing up in hospitals are linked to gatherings that are taking place in homes, birthday parties and funerals, said Olivia Kassiri, Public Health Director of Sacramento County. One cluster in the state capital region was caused by a single traveler. Someone traveled from another state and came to visit relatives, and then they all started falling sick, Kasiri said. In Fresno County, there is elevated disease transmission in skilled nursing facilities, the state said. Imperial County is seeing more cases as U.S. citizens cross the Mexican border seeking health care. San Bernardino is seeing a spike after gatherings for May holidays and outbreaks at prisons, jails and some skilled nursing facilities. The state is also watching San Joaquin, Tulare and Santa Clara counties for increases in cases or hospitalizations. California has had 133,489 total confirmed cases of the coronavirus and 4,697 deaths linked to it since the beginning of the pandemic. State officials reported a modest increase in hospitalizations statewide on Tuesday. Nearly half of all Californians live in one of the nine counties, according to a Reuters analysis. The rising concern in California comes as 21 U.S. states reported weekly increases in new cases of COVID-19, with Arizona, Utah and New Mexico all posting rises of 40 percent or higher. Arizona, which was among the first states to reopen mid-May, this week reactivated its emergency plan for medical facilities.